What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to the channel. Today is another hockey card video and I'm going to be opening up these two packs of hockey cards. So I ordered these cards from a website that lets you go in and look at all the cards they have available and choose which ones you want so you know what you're going to get. The reason I decided to order from them is because I wanted to get a lot of players that I PC and I wanted to grow my PC, my personal collection a little bit more and the cards I found on here were at reasonable prices. A lot of the cards are key players that I collect and this would have cost me about $30 but they had a sale at the time which only cost me $15. The cool thing about their receipt is all the cards that you picked are shown right here and all the individual prices are here. So these are all the cards that I've picked out. Let me open them up and show you what I got. Okay, so I have my two packs here. Let's start with this one. You guys already see the first player here. The first card here is P.K. Subain. 2017-2018 Opeachy Platinum. It is the Royal Blue Cubes. And as you can see there, it's numbered out of 100. It's 8 out of 100. So I needed this one for my collection. I think this one I'm going to be putting on display on my shelves. I did like that one. I don't have many P.K. Subain, but it's a player that I collect. Next up, also in a top loader, Rookie Materials for Malcolm Subain. I don't have any of his cards. So this one, I seen it and I had to get it. It was a pretty reasonable price too. That looks amazing. I'm definitely going to be putting this one on display in my room as well. So I'm really happy for that one. Now these ones here. Where is the... There we go. So you guys what I got in this one. Up first, Alex Ovechkin. This is the Rainbow. For 2016-2017, I collect some Ovechkin cards, so I've seen that one and I had to get it. Next up is Max Domi, Marquee Rookie. I didn't have any of his Marquee Rookies, so I really wanted to get it. To add to my small PC I have of his. I also got a Upper Deck Portrait of Tyler Sagan. You guys know the number one player that I seem to collect and I've been able to get the most of is Tyler Sagan. So I've seen this and wanted to grow my PC of him more. Also got one of Mark Fleury for the same year's Upper Deck Portraits. Oliver Ekman Larson, same year Upper Deck Portraits. I have a PC of his as well. And Alex Ovechkin, the same year Upper Deck Portraits. So like I said, I want to get a couple Ovechkin cards and that's why I added that one to it. Next up is Jonathan Bernier, Upper Deck Canvas. As I've mentioned before on this channel, I love the Canvas cards. And I have a small PC of Jonathan Bernier, so I wanted to add this to my collection. I really liked that card. Next up is Jonathan Bernier's Marquee Rookie. Like I just said, he's a player that I PC. I collect goalie cards, specifically his. So that one is a great one to add to my collection. I'm glad I found that one on the site. Next up is Brian Elliott's. I think this is the Rainbow Color Wheel. Yep. I collect some Brian Elliott's cards as well. I don't have many, but today I did get quite a few. I also got the Rainbow of his for the same year, Brian Elliott's Opeachy Platinum. I think this is 1617. And I also got another one for Platinum. And it is the blue, the ice blue tracks. So that one to me looks the best. But I do like that color wheel as well. So he's a player I PC. I've seen these cards and I wanted to get them. Next up is also Brian Elliott's Marquee Rookie card. The same year as Jonathan Bernier. I really like these cards. I like Bernier's a little bit better because I like the color scheme with the purple. And the last one that is in this pack is Tyler Sagan. Now this is the blue rainbow retro card and it is numbered out of 149. It's numbered 131. So to me, that one there, I believe is my best Tyler Sagan card. I have seen that and I had to get it because it looks so cool for my collection. It's the best one I have of his. Last pack here. This one got stuck, so we'll start with it. Another Tyler Sagan card. This is a numbered card. You can barely see it there. Numbered out of 199, it is 116. And it is the Star Trademark Relics. So I do like jersey cards. You guys know that. I've shared that on this channel before. 
I never had any Tyler Sagan jersey cards. I seen this and I had to get it. It looks phenomenal for me. This one's definitely going to be one that I put up on display. That one looks so freaking cool. Another jersey card I got is Jonathan Bernier's. I didn't have any of his jersey cards. As I said, I wanted to grow my PC of his. Seen this and I had to get it. Uh, it doesn't say on the back here. I think this is the bronze version I got. Comment down below and let me know. But that's the one I chose anyways on their site. So I think that's the one I got. And that looks amazing. So I'm really happy I got that card. Next up, everything else that's in here. I think you guys just seen which card that is. But I'm going to put that to the back anyways. Another Tyler Sagan card, Upper Deck Canvas. Like I've already said, I think in this video even, I love the canvas cards. They look so cool. I love art, and that looks so amazing. Another Andre Fleury card, a retro one for this past year. Yep, yeah, this past year. That looks amazing. Vegas Golden Knights, I think that's an amazing card to add to my collection. Next up. Let it focus here. Max Domi Upper Deck Portraits for this past year. I actually like this past year's Upper Deck Portraits. They look really cool. So I added that one to his collection. I also got Max Domi's. I forget the name of this. Uh, Violet Pixels. That looks amazing. That's my best Max Domi card, in my opinion at least. Other than now that the fact that I have his rookie card. Next up, Oliver Ekman Larson's rookie card. Managed to pick it up. He's a player IPC. I've already said that. And I wanted to add that one. Another Oliver Ekman Larson's. I love this year's retro cards, by the way. 16, 17 retro cards. That looks amazing, in my opinion. And I also got a Ovechkin. Same year's retro cards. So that looks pretty cool. Oliver Ekman Larson. This is the Ruby Shining Stars card. Add that to my Ovechkin collection. I don't have many of his cards. That's why I got quite a few in his today. Another Tyler Sagan card. Ruby Shining Stars. That looks amazing in my opinion. I love that. Next up is Connor McDavid Ruby Shining Stars. As you guys know, I have a small PC of Connor McDavid. I really want to get more. Seen this one and I couldn't pass for it. It's more expensive than the other Ruby Shining Stars. But then again, it is Connor McDavid. And the last card that I got from this site is Connor McDavid's retro card from this past year. Won't focus there. There we go. 1718 OPC Platinum Retro Card. To me, that looks phenomenal. That's the best Connor McDavid card I have in my collection, I believe. Other than some of the collector cards I have in my collection. So I did get quite a few Tyler Sagan cards. One, two, three, four, five I added to my collection. I already had more of his cards than any other player in my collection, so I think I grew his quite a bit. I did get some key players, some Brian Elliott cards, especially his rookie card. Jonathan Bernier and his rookie card got some Ovechkin cards, so this to me is amazing. I definitely would recommend checking them out. I'll leave a link to the site that I got these cards in the description down below. So hope you guys did enjoy today's video of me sharing what I got from my personal collection. I love the cards I got today. They're going to be perfect for my collection. Thank you guys for watching. Please take care. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.